Thanks, Scott. USC broke ground in 2014 to build the Gloria Kaufman School of Dance. Now, at the same time, department heads were also in the process of auditioning dancers from all over the world for its first inaugural class. And CBS 2's Andrea Fuji introduces us to a young ballet dancer who had to make a tough choice. Pat and Rick, so much talent here. Paulo Hernandez Ferrella studied with the best and attended the Los Angeles County High School for the Arts. But when it came time to choose universities, he had to ask himself, East Coast or West Coast? Well, tonight you'll see where he and other dancers are thriving. I was a really energetic kid. I was always moving. And then I found something that I could like smile <laughs> and be on stage and have people look at me and just be like the person I am. When Paolo Hernandez Ferrella from Eagle Rock discovered his passion for dance by the fourth grade, he focused all his energy into academics and honing his skills in ballet. When it came time to apply for college, Paolo aimed high. I wanted the top two. Uh, I only auditioned for the USC Gloria Kaufman School of Dance and I only auditioned for Juilliard. Juilliard, with its rich history in the arts, was his dream school. But USC's Gloria Kaufman School of Dance had an appeal that drew him in. This is, was a completely new program, but this program also had an amazing faculty. Here I'm studying with Jody Gates, William Forsythe, Desmond Richardson, names I hear every day in the world of dance. Jody Gates, a former ballerina with the Joffrey Ballet, is vice dean of the Kaufman School of Dance. She developed the curriculum from scratch for the inaugural class and auditioned every dancer in the program. Oh, Paolo's audition was extraordinary. I was thrilled when he came in. Paolo was accepted to both schools, but chose USC on a full scholarship. Not only did he want to continue excelling in dance, he was still driven academically, and USC could offer that. The students that come to this program, yes, to develop their dancing skills and the theory and practice of dance, are required to take the same academics as every other student across campus. Paolo is now a junior at USC, studying for a master's in public administration while dancing his way to a bachelor's degree in fine arts. Yes. The 54,000 square foot dance center opened its doors to its inaugural class in 2015. It's all the architecture in the Kaufman School of Dance is designed with the dancers in mind. From the tall windows that allow light into its dance studios to the curves and movement throughout the lobby. What makes Paolo and this group of 33 dancers so special is that they were the first to experience it all. I'm going to be on the wall of first forever here. It's a really humbling experience. Um, it's given me the opportunity to be a leader. We're kind of the pioneers. We get to actively create the program as it happens. <laughs> And when Paulo graduates in 2019, he hopes to have a long career dancing with ballet companies around the world. And later in life, he aspires to become the dean or president of a university. And he'll have the master's degree for that in his back pocket. Pat and Rick, back to you. Man shoots high. Yes, yeah. he does. Okay, <laughs> great dreams. Thanks, Ian.